What's going on YouTube? Gios no right here. So in today's video we're going to discuss about a flow that has been discovered by Abraham Masri on the iOS 11.3 and uh, this one is pretty interesting and he says in here quote dropping an iOS 0 day. Analysis of the process will be available soon. Now in order to make this clear uh, a zero day is pretty much a term used in the security research which means either a vulnerability or an exploit depending on the case uh, that hasn't been published up to that point. And the creator of the vulnerable system, in this case Apple, has no idea that this was a thing. So um, that's what a zero day is. But he later follows it up with, quote, this isn't an exploit, just a proof of concept, just saying, end quote. So he pretty much published this and um, he made a um, repository on GitHub about this. It's called Security D, which is Security Demon, Proof of Concept Overflow Vulnerability on iOS 11.3. Beta. It says a overflow vulnerability in Security D has been discovered. It allows full control of certain registers. More details can be found on the write up, and it's available in here under this name. And you can read more about the flow itself and about the, um, the vulnerability. Now, this isn't powerful enough to be used in a jailbreak, and it says in here, quote, Note, before you get too excited about this, let me tell you that this flow cannot be used in any useful exploit. I will explain below why it's not exploitable or critical enough to be considered a vulnerability per se. Now, uh, Saigusa, another developer who has developed the uh, double helix with Teamstar, the helix jailbreak, again with Teamstar, and the Phoenix jailbreak, still with Timstar, says in here, quote, um, sandbox escape root potential and the POC seems to crash in mem copy or something like that. So controlled registers are meaningless. Now, according to Segusa, the um, vulnerability or flow that Abraham Massey found in iOS 11.3 has the potential of sandbox escape, which is indeed useful for the jailbreak. But due to the nature of the vulnerability itself, it's hard to find a process that works with paths, because that's where the problem is, in order to uh, search for vulnerabilities in that process based on the research he has done on the info.plist path in here. So it's pretty hard to uh, use this one for a jailbreak. Now let me uh, read you what he says in here, quote, due to the nature of this flow, you cannot do much with it. However, it's important to point that such flaws do still exist in iOS, and while this flow might not be necessarily a vulnerability, it's a good idea to keep an eye on any privileged process that handles paths and attempt to find any potential vulnerabilities. So although this thing in here is not very useful for the moment, it opens some doors for more research because if there is a process on the iOS that handles paths and is vulnerable to this and it's a privileged process, so it runs on a, um, on a higher level than the user space, then it would be very useful to find a vulnerability in there and trigger it using these. So although this cannot be directly used for a jailbreak, although according to Segusa it has potential for sandbox escape, um, it's still a good thing and it's still good that he posted some information about it and he documented the um, the flow. If you want to learn more and you're interested in doing some research on the uh, iOS vulnerability, then you can go ahead and uh, read this right up in here, it's pretty well written, so I definitely recommend it. But yes, the answer is no. For the moment, this cannot be really used in an iOS 11.3 jailbreak. The reason I made this video is because a lot of people started to ask me about this vulnerability, whether I will make a video on it or not, or whether it's important or not for jailbreaking, since it apparently has been posted by Abraham Masri on his um, um, Twitter, and he is a known jailbreak developer and it has also been posted on reddit and people got curious so yeah, that's pretty much what's going on currently thank you for watching do not forget to subscribe to stay updated we'll keep you updated with anything that's going on in the jailbreak community i'm geosnow and till the next time peace out